right? I'm here with Saeed Haruna. This is Hello. not the first time you're seeing Saeed on this uh, YouTube channel. Saeed is the CEO of IAED and he's here to tell us about IAED. This is an exclusive one and what he expects from the game. So Saeed, you're welcome. Thank you. Yes, uh, people have been hearing about IAED. So just summarize IAED and why IAED is here today. Okay. So basically, IAED is a, um, a foundation that we started to basically to com uh, community development uh, okay. through education. Uh, we do a bunch of uh, pro programs in uh, low-income communities, for okay. people from low-income households, okay. uh, specifically based on around, uh, around education. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you are here today. This is, uh, of course, this is uh, an academic environment, of yes. course, but the university level. Yeah. So you, the Neem Foundation is here as well. So I don't know. Are you just here to play basketball together? Have you been challenging each other, or is yeah. there more to it? Yeah. So basically, um, some of the people from Neem Foundation are good friends of mine okay. as well and new foundation is actually very good they do a lot of advocacy they do a lot of integration for people that have been affected you know, by um, yes i was like happy Uber. about the yes. mental they, awareness they, part they, yeah yes. the mental awareness part so um we just wanted to use this opportunity to play a friendly game of basketball, you know, in a very social setting. Yes. But then use the opportunity to talk about what uh, NIM Foundation does, which is mental health, and what we do, which is education, which are the very two important things, uh, things that, that we need to discuss. Yeah, of course. Uh, and so it's just an environment where we, we have fun, we play basketball, uh, but at the same time, we see how we can use that uh, as a tool to raise awareness for yes. these issues. And do you feel it's going to make an impact? Because in environments like this, this gives people an opportunity to actually come out and talk. I believe yeah. there was a time I attended something where a lady mentioned that 7 out of 10 people uh, are mentally disabled. But yeah. it's just that it's not obvious. You don't have to be on the streets. Street. They are in Nigeria. Yeah. So, And I know the youth are the main concern of most people right now. Of course, at all age, their expectations. Yeah. So right now, since we are here alike, male, female, and people are going to come, how do you think this can, you can marry that with, uh, as in the people coming in to yeah. watch, yeah. how can you spread this awareness of mental mental health? How can you do that? Well, it really depends on how many people come to watch. Okay. Uh, we're hoping a lot of people come, even if it's just like a decent amount, but yes. we want to use, because this is, like I said, this is a social setting. Yes, of course. So when we have people coming to how like be entertained by people playing basketball we yeah. want to then use the half time to kind of talk about important issues because like you said there's a lot of things that people might not necessarily know yeah. about mental health but then when you're already in this type of setting you're already yes, of kind course, of focused of then you use the opportunity to talk to people and say this is uh, the, the kind of problems that people have in terms of mental health and in terms of education and then a lot of people that may have come to watch basketball will go home with added knowledge in terms of, of like, mental health and uh, education as well so that's what we're trying to use this for that because uh, maybe we're at a level where um, people might not necessarily just want to sit down and listen to people talk. Of if, course, if you come in a social in a setting, way that is going a different approach. Let's yes, say. yes. Okay. So the, it's really, it, it is really um, kind of we rely heavily on how many people are going to come. So um, that is going to determine yeah, the impact. Okay. okay uh, impact. But even even if not a lot of people come, this is the first of many that we hope yes. to. So okay. we'll just see how we can improve this event so that we can have. More on impact from the future. Yeah. All right. So before you go, we're going to deviate a little into trivia. Of course, you, you're a basketball player. Do you play basketball, or is it just a pastime? So you have to be very honest here. Yeah, I, I've <laughs> always loved basketball. Actually, I've okay, always loved basketball. So you're ready for today's game. I'm not very fit today, to be honest, but... <laughs> <laughs> Saeed, you knew this game was going to happen. Okay, you're not fit for today, but you're going to put in your best. It's yes, not about definitely. winning anyway, it's like you about said. It's about, about bonding and getting, getting to know yeah. people more and everything. Yeah. Okay, so I wish you I wish you all the best with today's game. Uh, thank and you very Well, much. I hope to see you after the game. I've seen before. I'll see the after. Uh, definitely. All right, <laughs> Saeed, thank, thank you very thank much. Thank you so much. Thank you.